Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Crate, and we are working on page nine. Page nine. Um, this is a very simple page. Two flaps. They are five and a half, five and a half by six, five and a half by six. They're going to get centered uh, up and down. So let's find our center line. There's four, and then this is six inches, so it needs to be at three. There we go. And I made a mistake earlier in the book and put one of my pages in upside down. Turns out I have enough paper that I can fix it, but I put an arrow uh, indicating up so I don't do that again. Um, it does happen. I was getting in a hurry. There we go. And let's verify. This is the up. So we're going to have the top flap come down. And be on top. Okay, there we go. Easy peasy. Okay, this is going to be our base. I need to get some ink on it. There we go. And then I've got these lined up for the inside, which I think look great. Oops, but they're shy. Oh, it looks like I cut these too small. I may have picked up the wrong papers. We'll set those aside and then I'll go through my paper stack and I, I may have um, picked up the wrong ones, hopefully. If not, I will figure something else out. There we go. And then here is what we're going to put down here. Oh, I forgot to mention this is... Uh, Eight by eight, tw 12 by 12, and this is eight by eight. Yeah, that's right. Just uh, sorry about that. Some days I'm really good about remembering, other days not so much. But if you have a question, shoot it to me in the comments and I'll do my best to answer it. You can really use either one. It's just about scale, right? Whatever you think looks best. Um, and since this is um, a smaller album, a six by eight, I'm I'm leaning more towards using up the eight by eight pad um, as the pattern, and the using the twelve by twelves on the flip side, which generally has a more um, repeated pattern on the other side. That's not as bold. There we go. Now I'm going to go see if I've mislaid these papers and I'll be right back. Okay, so it turns out um, I 
don't have any more of this paper, which is what my preference would have been. But I do have this and it's gonna work out. And I just, uh, it turns out I over trimmed these. I trimmed them to be for a four inch panel and not a four and a half inch panel, but no problem. There's plenty of paper to um, do an alternate choice, which is what I'm doing. And then also, this is my last page. I built this out of order, which I often do, even though you guys are presented it in order. Um, but I can tell you now that this is my last page that I definitely have enough paper left over to um, do our inserts, the uh, large pocket page inserts, but also enough paper left over to do some five by seven inserts uh, in various places throughout the album that I talked about as I was building it. Um, so we are going to have enough paper to do that. So that's going to be my next project. I will go over those in the walkthrough um, because it's too, most of the videos have already been uploaded to YouTube and it's too hard to go add just that little bit. Um, now I talked about it when I was building it saying that if I have enough paper, I'm going to do a five by seven insert. So I gave you the heads up, but I didn't know if I was going to have enough paper. So that is that. And this is page nine. <laughs> I have to rethink because I'm building it out of order. I really got to think about what I'm going to say. This is page nine and that's going to be it for the album. So the next time we get together, we are going to um, quickly add these to the, to the book and then um, offline, I'm going to go add some of those inserts and I'm going to go ahead and um, make the po the large pocket inserts and they will be five and seven eighths. Actually, I'll do five and three quarters by eight, five and three quarters by eight. And I'm, I'm going to verify the width because um, I want to make sure when I close the book that the inserts aren't going to hit the edge of the box. So I won't know the exact measurements until I'm finished, but it will be in the cut list. Okay, that's it for now. That's page nine.